My name is Ian Banda. I was born on uh, 11th February 1993. I'm the first born in a family of five where we are four boys, one girl, of which uh, two of us are born with uh, the same disability. The disability is called muscular dystrophy. I feel self-acceptance has been the main that has made me to be even where I am today. Shinankara John hit up with some life younger, Tina Pesic Amstration, Yavanava. A last Pacayan and Abola Nach to accept to be very any that she takes a mentor so many who are passed away when he can have a pocket video. I'm not making a show of Tina Bavay in which they want it, because they end up school among our hands are. There's over Papa Kumbuya, what they call school. I'm a youth disability right activist, of which I advocate for the rights of children and youths with disabilities, specifically children and youths because I feel that the next future generation to come. I'm a 2017 Mandela Fellow, uh, a program which is uh, supported by the U.S. government, of which I was, I went in the U.S. to be trained in uh, public management. Uh, with my education, I always try to utilize the knowledge that I have, get exposed to people, share my knowledge on disability rights, leadership of whom I'm also a mentor of 45 youths with abilities whom I'm training on disability rights and leadership. There's what started a So after that, one away, and I think in the Zoko Marite Sam, Marite of Movement, Kalapa Moza, the youth with disabilities. Now, when I had three Steve in the Hena Govinamba, Kalapa Govinamba, so I'm going to go to the Hena Govinamba. Okay, guys, this is why I'm not in big here. When I pulled up on the Vapoti, Madam and Tuman Sepold, Stephanie Gonkana, very famous, Stephanie Kakuba Patola. Different gaps and put everyone in separate stages. I've never turned to but turned to them in separate ones. It's the most most important. In a chamber, they can go there. Support. Mama, we decided to be my dear. Tia, teach the song. I'm in a fun of standing. I got to stand. I got to stand. I got to own. But it's a tia teach the continue. I'm in a chamber. They can go there. Teach it. Teach it. Now, more I'm also a lead citizen reporter, where I was trained in UK London on community reporting, on how to write up on the challenging story that children and youths with disabilities face. They're chasing my dream, I want to become the president, so I also be an example to any other youths with disabilities. From the time we spoke in 2019, uh, 2020, 20th March, I managed to form a youth led disability organization called Youth in Action for Disability Inclusion, which is the idea. The main aim and objective of the organization was to promote inclusion to children and youths with disabilities in social, political, economical, or spheres of our human development. Ever since the youth-led organization was formed, uh, we have managed to run four projects. One of the first projects we did was a research on the COVID-19 for young people with disabilities where we came up with a global report and the project was funded and supported uh, through Leonard Cheshire Disability in the UK. We also managed to do a research on the school bullying and violence of Leonard with disabilities in and outside of school because we wanted to realize some of the challenges that learners with disabilities go through when it comes to acquiring education. We have also empowered 500 young people with disabilities uh, in Lusaka and Mansa under our Enhanced Youth Employability Project, which was funded by Stanchart, where our young people with disabilities, including those without disabilities, were empowered uh, through different skills and uh, business opportunities. An idea was to have um, young people with and without disabilities to work together in order to promote inclusion and contribute to the economic of this country at large. I've gotten two awards. One of them, I got it in 2022 under the Chijika Gonga Award. On this award, I was awarded as the best disability inclusion expert in Zambia. The second one, I got it under Humanity for Disability Inclusion, which I got it this year, 2024, under the Adaptive 4.0 Award here in Zambia. I'm also a father of a three year, uh, seven months daughter. Her name is Priska, and I'm proud to be a father. If I can do it, you can also do it. <laughs>